What's going on guys? It's Crazy Dog here and today I wanted to do a very quick sort of first look at this product right here. This is from a company called Tekin, T-E-C-K-I-N I believe, and this specifically is the SS31. This is a smart home product that allows you to utilize one outlet and have it power up to two different devices. It is an outdoor plug, so it's IP44 certified. This means it can be used in outdoor and damp environments, but is still not recommended for any submersible use or anything like that. And what I plan on doing is actually automating both of my pool pumps for outdoor use. My outdoor outlet is actually controlled by a switch, and I don't always want to have the outdoor lights turned on because when they're on overnight, it's going to run my pumps uh, I have two of them, like I said before, and this guy here will just allow me to either use my application or use the auto scheduling functionality from this smart plug to control them overnight when we're not in it to make sure that the pool stays chlorinated. So let's actually take a quick look at what you get. We'll install it, we'll look at the app, and we'll see exactly how it functions. All right, so this is the product right here. I was gonna do a whole unboxing, but honestly, the packaging is just white, so the camera wasn't picking up the autofocus very well. But as you can see, very straightforward. We do have a ground plug on this guy, so just make sure whatever outlet you're using does offer the ground support as well. You have your on-off power switch here. That would be for manual use if you don't choose to use the application. Down here at the bottom, underneath these plugs, or plug covers, you do have the two independently controllable outlets. These are 110 grounded outlets. And based on what the back of this guy is saying, this is 15 amp, 125 volt, again, IP44 certified. It is good for up to 1875 watts, and it will operate in temperatures between negative uh, 20 and 60 degrees Celsius. That would be negative uh, four to 140 Fahrenheit. Um, I myself don't use those metrics, so negative 20 to 60 is perfect for me. Uh, this is controlled by the Smart Life app. We will be looking at that a little bit later on, and this is compatible with any device running Android 4.1 or higher, or uh, iOS 8.0 or above. So let's get this guy installed where I'm going to put it. We'll get the pool pumps plugged in, and then we will start the process of setting it up. All right, so here we are beside my deck. It is sort of like a, like a double stage deck, I guess. And right behind me, you can see this is actually where we have the outlet. So I have it plugged into one of the two outside receptacles. Again, this receptacle is typically powered on by using the outside lights. So if I leave the outdoor light on or the deck light all night, typically, unless I'm doing the pumps manually, it will run the pumps all night too. And I only typically like to use them for about four or six hours at a time. So I just decided to plug this guy in, plug the two pumps in, and this will allow me again to either control manually using the button on the plug itself or on the adapter, or use my Google Home or the application to fully schedule and automate these pumps so I can have them running overnight, but still actually have my outdoor lights on to make sure that we keep intruders off the deck or raccoons, or just so we can see if we tend to take the dogs out overnight. So let's jump into the application, see what that looks like, and then we'll see if we can't get this thing working. But so far, just based on how well it fits over there, I'm pretty impressed. All right, so it's all set up, everything's plugged in. I spared you guys the ride when I actually set up the equipment. It's very easy and straightforward to actually pair to your device. Simply hold the power button down for five seconds. It puts it in pairing mode open the app, search for the device, and the rest is history. You can name it, you can do whatever it is you wanna do, but I wanna go in and actually show you guys the application, and I'm going to try to record the screen on my S10 Plus, so hopefully this works. So we're going to open up the application itself. This is the Smart Life application, like I mentioned before. We're gonna get in here. I have it labeled as pool pumps. Again, this is whatever you guys wanna label it as, but for me, pool pumps, I plan on setting this up through my Google Home infrastructure. So I wanted to have the voice assistance there, but that's a long story for no reason. So you're going to see that I have pump one and pump two. Now you can choose to either turn them on independently. If we click the little schedule, you can set a schedule as well. But for me, I'm just going to be utilizing this for either all on or all off. So if I hit all on, hopefully you guys can hear that. The pumps are actually just right over there at a frame. So all on turned on the pumps. 
all off while turn off the pumps as well. So I'm gonna leave them running. Actually, no, I'm not, because it's gonna be noisy. Hopefully I don't do that too many times. Uh, but this is gonna solve a lot of problems for me, and that's fantastic, because having the ability to turn these on, or even if I forget to schedule them and I'm laying in bed, I don't have to get up out of my bedroom in the basement, come upstairs and either flip off the switch or come all the way to, out onto the deck and actually manually turn the pumps off. So having the peace of mind of doing it through an app is absolutely fantastic. The Smart Life app, this is an app that's been around for a while. A lot of non-Zigbee devices or just Wi-Fi direct devices from multiple manufacturers actually utilize it and it's got very high ratings on it. So I have no qualms or anything using this. It is set up and ready to go with the Google Home infrastructure as well as Alexa. And I think anybody that's looking to automate, like myself, pool pumps or outdoor lights for the holidays or an outdoor projector, really anything that you want to automate without changing out the actual outside receptacle, this guy can do for you. And it's very affordable. Uh, as per Amazon's new affiliate regulations, I can't tell you the price, but I can tell you that I will leave a link below for the specific plug for you guys to check out. And if you want to, pick it up for yourself. So also let me know in the comments below uh, whether or not you can use this yourself if you were to buy one and what you would use it for. And while you're down there, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also turn the notification bell on to make sure that you guys are notified for any future productions that I may get around to doing. Time has been short, but something like this guy here, you've seen a new environment. We're outside of the studio and I want to do more on the fly things like this. So again, leave a comment, subscribe, do the bell thing. Give me a comment about my awesome Rocco's Modern Life shirt that my wife found me when she was thrifting as well. And until the next video, guys, my name is Crazy Dog. You guys have been awesome and we'll catch you all in the next one. Take care.